yeah hello guys on today's video i'll be taking you through the process of how you can uh, cut a uh, material that is a uh, facing for a suit uh, lape with uh, how you can uh, also uh, cut the lining so i'll be uploading more videos on uh, how you can uh, make a uh, suit how you can uh, cut how you can uh, sew suit so gradually you can see that uh, we are getting to an advanced uh, class so now please if you are yet to subscribe to this channel make sure you click the subscribe button so that you don't miss any part of this uh, training so the, without any further delay let's get started so you lay the material you want to use for the facing in two layers like this and then the, you take the front panel of the suit the front panel of the suit you lay it on the material like this so make sure you open this side so i've already applied st on this so make sure you open it even if i've already folded the down parts Make sure you open it and you set all the edge make sure that the edge the material cover the edge as well so now the first thing you have to do is to first mark the upper part here you mark the upper part here that is where the material ended you end you mark it here and then you mark like a one inch here also at this uh, what from this uh, edge you mark like a one inch so you come to the down part also come to the down part as well then you mark two inches here you mark two inches here so then you cross it at the down again so the next thing you have to do now is to cut the material out So you cut it on the front like this and then when you get to the down part like this at the, the two inches which we notched before which we marked before you remark it very well so and at the upper part like this again you remark the one inch which we already which we already chalked before so that you'll be able to do the cutting from uh, from there so on this side you measure 2.5 you measure 2.5 on the side and then you drop down a bit and you measure 4.5 as well or you can as well measure 4 inches so let's make it a uh, 4 inches so you chalk it like this and then you cross it again so you cut it and then you do the you cross it again so once you do that then you remove it from the material so from that point now that is the place where you will do the coffin like this off it like this so make sure you mark this place as i'm doing the marking here so when i'm done with the with the cutting i believe this thing will be able to show properly very well so this chalk is not that uh, showing very well here so but when i finally do the cutting you can see how the shape it so make sure you follow the shape and then you do the cutting like this again with a half inch and then you cut it straight round you cut it straight round and when you get to this point where we cross you cut it again like this and then you shape it uh, round to meet at the point where the two inches ended and voila that's all so now let me recut this uh, side for me to for the shape to come out very very nice so you can see that so the next thing we have to do now is to cut the lining that will be for this uh, facing so now let's get to that so we first lay the material which we want to use for the lining like this and then you place the you place the facing on it make it overlap with like a one inch so let me mark this place let me roll this one inch out for you to see where the overlapping will fall on but you don't necessarily need to do the to roll this place as i'm doing it here you don't necessarily need to to do that if you want to cut your your own so i'm just using this to serve as a guide on where the on where the facing that is the facing will overlap on the on the dress so once you do that you just place it like this and then on the most off area of this uh, facing you make it overlap on the lining with like a one inch 
with one inch you can see the place that i roll that it stop at that point so that's the essence of a uh, that's the reason why i roll it out so that you'll be able to know where the overlapping will end so you mark you measure 2.5 at the top here and then you just mark it you mark this place also you mark it like this and then you do the marking round so once you mark all these uh, angles the next thing to do now is to place the material itself on it so that you'll be, you'll be rest assured that the facing over all the areas so, so once you place it like this and then the next thing to do now is to mark one inch at the back so at least you leave a space of a one inch or 1.5 at the at the back like this so that is the essence you will need at the at the back so make sure you have an excess at the back like this and then you cut it out you can as well make the excess to be like a uh, two inches so make sure you have that excess so then you do what you remove it again from the from the material so you can now now trace out the shape which we have on the which you have on the facing so you can trace out the shape now so you do the same thing at the down part again so you trace it out so please if this is the first time you are checking on this channel you are highly welcome to Nobuti fashion channel this is the channel that brings you the easiest fastest and then the simplest uh, method so do where to click on the subscribe button so that you'll be notified whenever i drop an amazing video like this again so the next thing to do now is to cut it out so but you are not cutting out from that place which we have uh, the marking so you have to cut out like from a uh, one inch from that place which we have a which i have the marking so the marking that i'm cutting from on this down part that i've left the essence on it again so from the point where the lining that is the facing ended i've already left the essence so that is why i'm cutting it out on that edge, marking at the down part so the next thing you have to do after you have cut it out is to notch the point where the facing ended on all the lining so this is the point where the facing ended here and this is the point where the facing ended here also and there's another thing that's very important here make sure you write up and down on each of this uh, lining for you to differentiate the up from the down and that is all on how to cut the facing for the lapel and then the lining in the subsequent video i'll be taking you through the process of uh, how you can uh, stitch this uh, lining on the facing so please do where to click on the subscribe button turn on the notification bell so that you will be notified whenever i drop an amazing video like this again so thank you for watching and say remain Bless. Bye for now.